I rise to speak to my Amendment 49, uh, which uh, puts a clear and unambiguous environmental duty on Ofwat. In fact, it gives the authority a primary duty to protect the environment. Now, I'm well aware that uh, the government probably will come round to the Greens' way of thinking in 10 or 15 years, and perhaps this side of the chamber might come round to um, our way of thinking in, in 25 or 30 years. But the fact is, we have to care now about our environment, about our planet. And I feel that what we have passed so far, although very welcome, is just not enough. Natural flood management is actually proving, as noble lady, Lady Willis said, um, is proving to be a cost-effective way of reducing flood risk, far cheaper than the traditional construction involving lots of concrete. Um, water companies should be investing in these nature-based solutions to reduce the infrastructure cost of handling surface water runoff, because every litre of water that soaks into the ground is a litre of water that doesn't flood into the water treatment system. Uh, I have two requests of the noble lady and the minister. Uh, will the government amendments now provide a baseline and therefore the minister take forward a piece of work to expand the use of natural flood management, especially where it's significantly cheaper than other methods? And secondly, will the government please put these climate and nature amendments on the face of their bills at drafting stage rather than having to amend them down the line?